hi and welcome to my youtube channel my name is manas and if you are first time here or new to my channel uh, i post yoga fitness lifestyle and traveling related videos every week uh, sorry for last two weeks uh, i was a little bit busy and the weather was not so good so i couldn't able to uh, shoot the video but uh, okay Lots of uh, young uh, subscriber ask me, uh, please uh, show some yoga postures that can help to increase the height. So I think need to do that video uh, today. So I will show you five yoga posture can help you to increase the height. So. Uh, before we go for the postures, you need to rem you need to understand the height is uh, always depend on your gene. Like if your parents and grandparents uh, are tall, uh, then you gonna be tall. So uh, you but you can uh, enhance, you can uh, increase your height with some yoga posture and some workout. So I will show you five. I will show you five yoga postures can help you uh, to increase your height. So let's get ready. Get off with your practice cloth, and we'll learn five yoga postures for increase height. Okay, the first posture is Tadasan. So let me show you how to do Tadasan. Feet together, relax your shoulders, inhale, raise your hands up, interlock your fingers, open your palm towards the sky, inhale, slowly raise your heel up as much as you can, come up on your uh, toes, on your sole, hold this posture for 30 seconds to 1 minute. During the posture, just keep breathing. Don't hold your breath. And then slowly release your hands. Drop your heels. Relax your shoulders. Okay, the next posture is Tiryak Tadasan. Feet together. Open your feet, keep distance apart. Relax your shoulders, inhale, raise your hands up, interlock your fingers like this. Open your palm towards the sky, inhale, raise your heel up, come up on your sole. Exhale, turn your body towards right side. Make your balance and hold this posture here for 30 seconds. Slowly inhale, come to center. Drop your heel down. Once again, left side. Inhale, raise your heel up, stretch your hands towards the sky. Exhale, turn your body towards left side. Then, like right side, hold here for 30 seconds. Keep your tailbone, your neck, your crown in a one line. Keep your arm beside your ear. Slowly inhale, come to center. Exhale, drop your heel on the floor. Relax your arms down. This is the second posture, Tiryak Tadasan. Okay, third posture is sitting posture. So Paschimottanasan. So for Paschimottanasan, open your legs. Legs together. Flex your feet. Inhale, raise your hands up. Exhale, bend forward. Let's just try to catch your toes. If you can't catch your toes, you just hold from your ankle and try to lengthen from your low spine. Exhale, bend forward. Try to go close as much as you can.
and slowly inhale raise your hands up spine straight exhale relax your hands down hold this posture for 30 second to 1 minute and then fourth posture is bhujangasan so for bhujangasan lie down on your stomach keep your hands beside your chest spread your fingers your feet slightly apart inhale raise your chest up shoulder down try to bend from your upper back middle back open your chest towards the sky head back close your eyes breathe here hold this posture for 15 to 20 second and slowly release this posture and take rest a little bit here for 10 second to 15 second like this and the fifth one fifth and the fifth and the final one is bridge pose or well pose is different on you if you are a regular practitioner if you can do the well just go for a well pose or you can start with the bridge pose so let me show you first the bridge pose lie down on your back bring your feet closer towards your hip straight your hands if you can you can catch your ankle and flatten your feet on the floor head straight chin slightly towards your chest inhale deeply exhale raise your hip up from the ground like this and then breathe here and slowly release this posture drop your hips down relax your hands this is this is the bridge pose if you are new to practice just do the bridge pose or if you are practicing regularly you can go for the wheel so for wheel posture lie down on your back your feet hip distance apart try to bring your feet closer towards your hip spread your toes bring your hands beside your head flatten your palm on the floor your fingers should pointing towards the shoulder inhale deeply exhale raise your hip up raise your lower back up and up from the ground hold this posture for 15 to 20 second and then slowly flatten your back on the floor and don't forget to do the power muktasan the counter posture for full pose just do a little bit power muktasan flatten your lower back on the floor and just move your body side to side and then slowly open your hands down open your legs straighten your legs out open your hands down and just hold stay here for savasan just few seconds savasan here you can do 1 minute or more than that then slowly turn your body towards right side and slowly get up okay this uh, five posture will help you to uh, increase your height so just keep practicing this uh, Uh, regularly every day and it will help you to improve your height so if you can add jump ropes and uh, pull up or chin up with this it will also 
uh, kick up your height goals. Uh, uh, with this practice, you need to uh, focus on your sleeping and on your diet. So uh, just try to get uh, six to eight hours good sleep and uh, eat healthy diet and it will help you to increase your height as well. So this five posture not only help you uh, to improve the heights uh, if if even uh, your goal is not to increase your height if you practice this five posture uh, it will help you to improve your postures like lots of people work in the office and uh, sit on the decks for uh, 8 to 12 hours so if you are a uh, office working person or if you work uh, with the computer for 8 to 12 hours just practice this uh, five posture it will improve your posture keep your spine um, straight and healthy so that's all for today uh, Looking forward to see you again next week. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon so you can get the notification for my latest video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again next week. Namaste.